get the hell out of me. How long have you been there? Bloody hell. Right. Um, it's Tuesday, 30th of November. Don't creep up on me. Um, time for another writing prom prompt. No ifs, ands, or buts. Uh, if you're joining in, hashtag knifes. I've added the hand gesture just for fun. This is the book we'll use today. This is it. This is the game. Book I had to explain to my wife why I bought it. Let's pose for the thumbnail. There we go. Um, so, uh, really interesting book from a marketing perspective. How people work. Anything. The best books about marketing often aren't marketing books. They're books, they're books like this. Books that explore what makes people do things. And this is a really good book. Very small font though. So, if you're like me, old, need readers, this is the book. So, I'll flick through and I will find a writing prompt for you. Just a word. An interesting word just to kickstart your writing. And then I'll give you a bit more of an oomph in the direction of creating something by telling you here's what I would do with this word. So, you know what, let's just make things easier. I'm clearly up to this part of the book. So, let's go here. Random page. Just go there and I will stop here. Nearest interesting word. The word I landed on was A-M-O-G, which is an abbreviation in the pickup artist words. I'm not quite sure what it is. So let's go to the nearest one. T-shirt. Let's go with T-shirt. That's the one directly below it. Now, T-shirt is quite an interesting word. Immediately what I'm thinking about, here's what I would do with this. So when I think about T-shirts, what I'm thinking of is jokes and slogans that people have on T-shirts. So maybe this is a good chance, instead of an email, instead of a social media long form post or anything like that, maybe this is a chance to come up with a, a motto you'd put on a T-shirt for your audience. So if you had to sum up everything you do, everything you know about your world, everything that you, all the skills you have to make your client's life more awesome, what would that look like as a, as a logo, as a motto rather, on a t-shirt? So for me, the thing about insert gag here, it's not always been about just being funny, it's how would I say this? So maybe I'd do something like that. So we've got t-shirt, use that as a prompt, and think about what your motto would be. If you had to boil it all down into a pithy phrase, what would that be for a t-shirt? And then talk about that. How would I say this? That's what it is for me. What is it for you? If you had to boil all your lessons down to one thing, what would it be? So that's what I do with the word t-shirt today. Of course, you're free to do whatever you like. If you want me to see what you're writing, use the hashtag knives and I'll see it. I'll give you, since I've given you quite a big explanation there, I'll give you one second to think about how you're going to use t-shirt today. Done. So that's your prompt for today, Tuesday 30th of November. Um, I'm going to dive back into this book because it's bloody interesting. But I'll see you tomorrow for Wednesday and December. See you for tomorrow's prompt.